My name is Ilias Beneni. Growing up, I was overweight and I lacked confidence. I was into drugs and alcohol at the age of 13. And at the age of 16, I started my self-improvement journey and I turned my life around. Now I'm 21 years old. I have my own marketing agency. I'm an entrepreneur and I'm in the best shape of my life. I'm on a mission to live amongst the top 1% of men and in this show, I will teach you everything I learned along the way. This is the 1% Men. Welcome guys, today I'm going to talk about the five best apps that I think that can improve your life. Okay, so why did I choose this topic? You're probably using your phone every day, but are you using your phone useful? That's the question of the day. So, Let's hop into it and men. So here are some tips uh, what you can do right now to uh, yeah, use your phone more useful. Uh, so the first one is unnecessary apps. Uh, and I know you need social media and you need WhatsApp and all your things, but try to use it more manageable. So for a different specific time, uh, two hours max, maybe. For in the video, I will tell you about five different apps I think uh, are the best to help you become the 1% man, to help you achieve your goals. But for now, I have these little quick tips. So the, the second one is download an app that uh, gives you a manageable overview of how much you're using your phone, because it's very important and you can see which app you're using directly right now and which app you're using the most and why and what you're doing about it. But uh, that's for that. Let's hop into the five apps I think are the best. So the first one is Blinkist. What is Blinkist? Paid app, uh, firstly, and it gives you access to short books, uh, short podcasts, and short audio books. So these are summaries of them, custom made by them. So why should you use it? And why am I using it? It's because it's in 15 minutes, you read the whole book, but you get the key uh, points of the book. Uh, because I have very less time uh, to read whole books, Mostly there are like 200 pages and I want to read quick books. I want to get the key points of them. So that's the reason why uh, I uh, use Blinkist. So that's the first one. The goal of this app is to improve your knowledge. It's a very quick way to let you read books, and listen to uh, complete audio books and podcasts. So the second one the app is called My Fitness Pop. The main goal of that is, my, uh, is food management. I use it on a daily basis to track my macros, to track my calories, to track what I eat. It's very important for me because I exercise a lot and I want to eat the perfect amount to get the best results uh, with muscles. And as you know, food is very important if you train, if you exercise, it's very important for you. So this is the best app, one in my opinion, that you can use uh, yeah, to get uh, your food managed and get them tracked. Third one is Google Agenda. So the first thing that I want to mention on Google Agenda is that's for time management. The other one was for food management. This is for time management to see when I have meetings, uh, when I have to do what, to planning um, tasks, goals. Uh, so without Google Agenda, my whole plan or my whole business would be a complete mess and you will not even see this video because I didn't have time to develop this video at that point. I re really like this like this tool. Um, so that in my opinion, I think it's the most important of all five that I'm going to mention right now. So uh, yeah, just try it. Yo, bro. Yo, man. Am I disturbing you? Uh, actually, I was filming a video right now. Oh, I want to ask if you want to go to the gym tomorrow. Um, I have to think about that. Let me check my Google agenda. Oh, nice. I've been using it as well. Really? Very nice. I was talking about it. Oh, really? Uh, yeah. Uh, Google agenda say that I have time tomorrow. Which time? Two o'clock. Two o'clock. Perfectly. Planned it. See you soon. See you soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye -bye. So let's hop into number four. We have number four is habit now. Uh, the goal of it is to manage your habits, as it said in the name. What the goal of that is, is to track your habits. Habits are very important. If you are a long time in the self-improvement world and you read a lot about uh, self-improvement, you see that habits uh, plays a big role in that. 
because habits are the things that you will do on a daily basis. So in a morning routine, as example, uh, I have exercising. When I did that, I uh, check it off. Um, take my skincare routine, all these kind of things, you can check them off. So you still have to be organized. And what I first did is I had it on paper with Excel. Uh, it's very annoying because you always have to be constantly at, at your laptop or PC. So it's a little bit annoying. So with this app, I easily get my phone, which is constantly with me and I can check it off very easily. And it keeps me on track with my goals. Number five, Trello. Trello is for project management. Uh, but with Trello, you can do a lot of things. You can create to-do lists, you can structure product, uh, projects, the same as Google Agenda, but Google Agenda, you can plan it in. But with Trello, you can actually set your tasks down, uh, create a structure for your company, uh, for your projects. So as example, if you have three different projects, you have to work on school, uh, you have to work on your business and you have to work on your personal level. You can write down, okay, what I have to do for school, what I have to do for uh, my personal level, what I have to do for the business. And then I can see, okay, what what is the priority of what? And then you can plan it at all. Yeah, so Trello um, gives you a very organized feeling and lets you uh, create an overview of your goals, of your tasks, and what has to be done to achieve your goals. Yeah, I really recommend it. So all these combined give you the complete package to manage all your things, get an overview, be structured, get organized, and stay on focus on your goals. And this is what you need if you want to become the 1% man. So I hope that it is understandable for you guys. Let me know if, if, which apps you actually use at this time or if you have any recommendations, let me know. And uh, I will speak to you in the next video, guys. Bye-bye.